Now for this card, I'm going to take two sheets of this fantastic holographic card. I'm just going to put one to one side for a moment. And what I've got here, I've taken some background paper and I've just cut it slightly smaller all the way around. And I've just put some double-sided tape down this edge. Now if I take this away like that, and then I can stick that down. So that will still lift up like that, form a kind of an insert. Next, what I'm going to do is put some more double-sided tape down the side here and stick that down over the top there like that. And then I'm going to crease it and then that will be able to lift up and down. So I've stuck those two together there now and I'm just going to take my ruler and about half of an inch in, I've just got my steel ruler and I've just got an embossing tool here and I'm just going to crease it all the way down there like that. So that will be able to bend perfectly now, like so. And then I can bend that over as well. So I've created the card like that. And that's what I'm going to base my design on. Now I've printed off another sheet of this beautiful background paper. Turn that over and now I've got my mask here. Uh, my template and I'm just going to position that over the top make sure it's not going to go up to the edges where it's nice and white and then just take your pencil and this is the first part of the template just draw around it and then cut it out. I've also cut out the next section and I've edged it with some nice silver paper to match the card. I've also done the template with the centre of the uh, design as well and then also stuck that onto some of the silver paper and just cut around that so it's got a nice edging of the silver holographic. And also from the uh, nice green holographic card here, I've cut this one out and that's going to be at the top of the bauble. Now I've stuck the first part of the template to the card, the front of the card, and I've got my mat here underneath so I can measure this up and I'm just going to score across. I want to do it about there, I think, because I'm going to cut this top part out. But if I just line this up first and then take my uh, embossing pen and just mark it there like that, either side, and then you know where to start cutting. And then take a nice pair of scissors and first thing I'm going to do, you're cutting through everything here, is just lob off all the excess here and then you can cut round the outside, the top part of the bauble and just make it a nice edging all the way around. So just cut that out carefully, but start where the creases are so it ends up in the right place. So there you can see how I've cut all the way around the edge there, leaving that border so that your card is going to end up like this. So you've got the top part cut off and that will all, you've cut it all at once and that will open up nicely like that. So that's ready now for decorating up. And I've got double sided foam pads on my first section and I just have to line this up just about there and stick that down perfectly. And here's the next section of the Christmas bauble with a nice backing paper there and that's going to fit over the top like that. Perfect. And I've got the next section here, that's the top of the bauble here, and I've got double sided foam pads on the back, and that's going to stick down just over the top like that, allowing some of the uh, silver to show through. Now that's the main part of the bauble card, the big bauble card, and now we can decorate that up any way we want. And I've got one of the uh, Father Christmases that the background papers are based on and I've cut out the first part of the 3D layering or decoupage and I've put my foam tape on the back ready to go on the card. Now all you've got to do is layer them up. So there's the first part stuck on the card and now I just have to layer the second section of the decoupage over the top of that, precisely over the top.
And I've also stuck the main picture on the inside of the card there. And then you can add any kind of sentiments, peel-offs, whatever you want, nice big bows, perhaps a little sentiment down in that left-hand corner or right-hand corner.